Hey YouTubers, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Ken Domic food review just for you. Earlier on today, I posted an Instagram photo saying, let me know what you want me to review today for today's food review. And at least four people wanted me to go to Smokes Poutinery, which we haven't done in a very, very long time. So I drove all the way up to Barrie, Ontario, Canada to Smokes Poutinery because one of my followers on Instagram said, let's do a Mexican poutine. Uh, they had two on the menu. One was called the Mexican Scrambler and the other one's called the Nacho Grande. And I think I'd prefer to do the Nacho Grande because it has jalapenos on it. Why wouldn't you? All right. so. This poutine, which probably weighs about one and a half pounds, is $8.99 plus a bottle of Coke. Road trip! Show the logo. I had to take a couple sips before the show because I was waiting for this thing to cool down. And the whole thing after taxes came to $12.41. This, again, is something you could probably share with somebody so you can knock the price in half. I know it looks messy, people, but I'm sure it's going to taste great. It has melted a lot because of the heat of the gravy. So what we got here on the bottom is French fries, cheese curds, and poured over with super hot gravy. And then they put chili, salsa, sour cream, jalapenos, guacamole, all mixed up into one crazy ass Canadian poutine and Mexican crossbreed. Let's go in for a bite and let's see how it tastes. Okay, I'm gonna try and get a little bit of everything. A little bit of guac, one of the jalapenos. It's gonna be pretty freaking crazy in here. I'm not sure how long I'm gonna be able to hold it. There we go, I think I've got everything in that bite. I know it looks like roadkill, people, but it ain't. Jalapenos are really hot. The chili flavor is taking over pretty much everything on this and the salsa. So what I'm tasting right now is just basically chili, salsa, and french fries. And of course the heat of the jalapeno. Let's get a, let's go for another chunk here. Hope this isn't making you hungry, people. If this is your first time stopping by KBD Productions TV, please hit the subscribe button. But what I'd like to ask you guys is if you like this video and you wanna see me come back and do the Korean barbecue poutine, let's try and get 1,500 thumbs up, ding, 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 as I burp, and I'll come back and do the Korean barbecue poutine just for you. All right, bite number two. Pretty much got everything on there except the guac. Mm. I didn't get a jalapeno. Again, the chili and the, and the salsa are taking over. Although I got gravy, french fries, and a cheese curd on that one, it is overpowering the, the actual poutine. If you're interested in just eating a poutine, I suggest you don't get this one because you're, you're losing out. But the combination of everything is, is pretty good so far. Oh. I got more guac on that one, and that tasted really good. I'm trying to dig down deep. Oh, and all that gravy, people. Mm. I am digging this Nacho Grande poutine from Smokes Poutinery enough it is worthy of a hunger alert just for you. And I have scooped up a lot of stuff. I'm already getting the burps happening thanks to smokes. There is a huge hunger alert bite. Are you ready? Here we go. Mm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know Ken Domic is always hungry. So I'm gonna polish this off and I'll be right back. Hang on. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am all done. On my rating scale, I am gonna give Smokes Poutineries Nacho Grande a total recommend if you love nachos. The two ladies that were working the counter today, I asked them what they liked better, the, the Scrambler or the Nacho Grande. They both 
smiled and said the nacho grande is their favorite because they love the chili, they love the sour cream, the guac, and all that other stuff on it. So if you're interested in a, a nacho grande smoked poutinery, it's a total recommend from KBD Production TV. Don't forget guys, if we can get 1500 thumbs up, I'll come back as soon as we get the 1500 thumbs up for the Korean barbecue. All right guys, if you enjoyed watching this video and you do not want to miss the next one, especially if it's going to be the Korean barbecue one, hit the subscribe button. It is right around here. But if you enjoyed watching me eat a nacho grande poutine, hit it with a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Ken Domic food review. Ken Domic out. Boop. Smokes poutinery to try a new, it's not a new. And then they had the uh, nacho, so I drove all the way up, big truck, salsa, jalapenos, uh, it's freaking hot, man. Storms are coming. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.